Hey, what's going on guys, Toadie Worthy here, and welcome back to another tutorial part of our Minecraft Modding 1.12.2 tutorial series. And in this episode, we are going to be going over um, how you can use Or Dictionary. So if you don't know what Or Dictionary is, it basically allows your items to be used in crafting recipes with other mods so if they, so say another mod has a copper ingot and your mod has a copper ingot and you want your copper ingot to be able to be used in their recipe which includes a copper ingot and the way you do that is by using or dictionary so this is a thing that forge has created and it's very useful so we're going to just go on how to do it and it's actually not that difficult so let's get started inside of your handlers package or in its package um, in fact we'll create it in our init package oh no not new package inside of init we want to do new class and we're going to call it um, or or dictionary uh, and in fact we want to call it um, or dictionary in it so that we don't have the same name as the forge class inside of here you want a public static void uh, register ors inside of this you want to do or dictionary if we just wait for my Eclipse to load these all up. We need to do or dictionary dot register or and here you put the name of the or and for or you put um the item or the block. So let's start with um an ingot for example. So item in it and we should have an obsidian ingot, right? So for this, what you would want to put is ingot obsidian. That's not how you spell obsidian, is it? Is it iron? Okay. Sid. Right, there we go. So that's what it would be. Um. Now this name is kind of just you guessing. Um. You can find a list of the vanilla ones, so if you go into the ordinary class um, and you look here inside of init vanilla entries, you can see what the vanilla things are called. So logs, uh, log wood, and all these different things, um, which is very useful. Um, and these are the things that don't have anything. But here is all the different things very useful um, and basically if your item that you want to have as or dictionary is an ingot you would put ingot and then in capital capital for the first letter and then um, that ingot type um, so say you wanted to do a ruby I don't think we have an, or, or just a gem of some sort you would do or dictionary dot register or you would put gem and then uh, gem name so for example uh, ruby so it'd be gem ruby and then you do item in it dot um, ruby just like that um, obviously we don't have ruby um, and you can also do this with blocks as well so uh, for a block you might do block um, let's say we just want to do tin because I think we have tin or do we have silver we have silver right so you would have block silver and then you would do comma um, block in it dot silver block and that would just register that so um, if you go on to the utilities or dictionary you can see um, on the forge docs it kind of tells you 
um, down here in the common or dictionary names you can see um, there's or so for example or copper um, or uh, ingot copper nugget copper dust copper gem ruby dye black I don't know uh, block emerald stone and then your stone name crop um, whatever slab whatever stair whatever you get the point and they're the uh, they're the they're the normal minecraft ones but here is the normal modded ones so f for example gear so gear copper uh, rod copper stick copper uh, plate copper dust tiny copper and cover copper um, obviously there are loads more you kind of have to guess um, if you see it should say that somewhere um, let's have a look here you go so because all dictionary names are not meant to be shared between items from different mods they should be fairly general use a name that other mods are likely to use so um you don't actually know so like as it says here the entire or dictionary name typically uses camel case um if you don't know what that is it's it, it does say what it is here if you don't know what that is um and avoid spaces and underscores so don't have spaces and underscores and numbers would probably be a bit weird um, it's very unlikely that another mod would use numbers uh, yeah the first word indicates the type and the second is the material obviously so for example uh, copper aluminium lead steel etc as it says so yeah that's that's that basically um, so I'm just going to do these two for now um, and close these now inside of your registry handler you can go ahead and in I think it's pre in it oh, no in it inside of in it you can do or dictionary in it dot register ors simple as that um, now I don't actually have a way to test this because I don't have any other mods installed um, but obviously you can go ahead and test that yourself and it should work um, so yeah that's actually it guys so if you guys did enjoy this video please do be sure to I'll see you guys next time goodbye